how to jailbreak your iPod Touch 2.2.1. Alright. What you need to do first is make sure your iPod is plugged in and it's on. Alright, so once that's done, you need to open Quick Freedom, which out of common sense you should have installed the firmware and the Quick Freedom from the sidebar. Alright, so you might want to pause the video while you do that. And um, now that you have it, open Quick Freedom, click Jailbreak, and the first thing you're going to want to do is click Install LIB USB. Won't pause the video. Now that you have that installed, you need to make sure it has the check. Sometimes it doesn't automatically refresh, so you might want to close out of it and reopen it. Now you should have the check. Alright, now you want to make sure it has the original 2.2.1 firmware found. If it's not already checked, which it should be if you installed the firmware, browse for it. Find it in your computer, and it should look like this. The little box. Alright. So we're just going to click next and make sure both of these are unchecked. Then you click click create firmware and just wait till that's done. Pause the video since I've already done it and um click next. All right, now here's the sort of tricky part for some people. All right, what you need to do is take your iPod, press the power button and the home button at the same time, and hold them until you hear the little beep in Windows. Then, after that beep, let go of the power button, but still hold the home button for another 10 seconds or until you hear the beep. So, once you have that done, it should say in this little box, um, system in recovery mode and ready to start pre-jailbreak. So once you see that line of text, click start pre-jailbreak. Now I've already got this done and um, you might just want to pause the video because I'm moving on. Alright, click next. Alright, now this is all garbage. You can just click click next and close out of it. Alright, now that you have this custom firmware on your desktop, which you should if you did everything right, let's just move over to here. Alright, now you see this restore. The thing you're going to want to do with this restore is look closely. Shift, click, so that this is open. Make sure you're holding shift while you click. So click custom firmware and and click open. That's going to restore your iPod with the jailbroken software. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. Um once you have that you're going to have to uh wait while your iPod gets um, restored with the custom firmware and you're gonna reset your iPod and do all that stuff and when you turn it back on there's gonna be another program it's called Cydia I think that's how you pronounce it but um once that's on there you should check out my other video which will be put up shortly or tomorrow or sometime and um It will tell you how to get themes and different apps using City. Alright. Hope I helped. If you need a, if you need any more help or you have some questions or anything, just message my YouTube account. Um so long.